thanks for being here, mostly in time. It's wonderful to have a full audience for this topic, for the topic of national development. Uh, as Mr. Seiss already uh, has mentioned, we have an excellent set of speakers this afternoon addressing this topic from a number of different angles from public institutions, from national international bodies, and of course from an industry perspective as well. And I'm pretty confident we will be able to put together a complete picture from different angles and hopefully have some time in the end uh, for some interesting mutual comments and questions. Let me add one little tidbit to my own introduction because I believe it's, it's interesting and relevant for much of what we all do. Uh, I'm currently leading the interfaculty department of geoinformatics at my university. And the key point here is interfaculty. Uh, we used to be natural science with a close link to technology. We work with social science. We work with the medical school and the law school. So geoinformatics and geographic information science obviously is all of the above. It's not in any one of the little boxes anymore, uh, but it cuts across. And this is part of the story why it's relevant not only somewhere down the hierarchy in the technology area, in managing our nations, our infrastructures, our economies, uh, but it's very clearly relevant on the top level across the board. And this is what we see in this event, and I would like to commend the organizers of really conveying this story very, very well. I'm very honored to introduce the first speaker in this afternoon. This is Mrs. Saskia Stoeveling. Uh, she is with the Auditor General of the Netherlands, President of the Court of Audit. Uh, and I'm looking forward, and I think I can say that on everyone's behalf, uh, to this perspective on the role of geospatial in the context of national development. Mrs. Stoeveling. 